Hey guys, RC here, back with episode 6 of Surviving Mars. We are playing as Russia on 555% difficulty. We have analyzed that anomaly. We have the people coming back. All right, let's send him off for the RC transport. Now, what we need to do here is our RC transport is here. So let's uh, turn off auto gather and we'll bring him off over here and tell him to unload, unload resources, please. We'll make sure he's coming back over this way. There he is. Hopefully he goes around that area by himself. Eh, he didn't. It looks like he's okay. And there he goes. You have to kind of turn them off, make sure they're not working on anything. Uh, where are you? All right, you're up here. You know what? I'm going to bring you more towards the middle. That way you can help load up. Uh, I don't need that right now. In fact, I'm going to turn that off. Let's see if we can get some food in for our concrete for a little while. Uh, yeah, 50 concrete for 81 food. I will go for that. Uh, we do have one unemployment, so let's see what we can do. All right. Doctors are full. I would like the doctors to be more full. So let's go ahead and take him and set that workplace. And there you go. Gained 30 more polymers. So that's good. We won't need polymers for a little while. Uh, this will be at 100% when we finish this run. So I'm going to go ahead and put potatoes in the rotation. And we should be cranking food out pretty willy-nilly at that point. All right, we're down to one, stu one child. All right, we are up to five people here. So let's look at our people. So we have 11 Martian-born. So we've almost doubled our population, which is a good thing. That is a very good thing, especially with only one rocket that we're doing anything with. Um, I am gonna build a I am gonna build a food depot just kind of off to the side here, close enough to unload the rocket, but not but then that's close enough to get it over to the domes with the other drone hubs over here. Two anomalies found up here. That's good. So here he comes, uh, and you, where are you at? Let's get you up here, and then you can start gathering all of those resources, and then we will finish that up. Do I want to send him now? Oh, you know what? Let's see if, I didn't, I forgot to spin the earth and see if there was anything else. There's not. What is that? So we could redo this, and this is like a repeatable, so you could spend the 30 electronics, pick up, but it's, you see instead of 2 billion, it's only 1.75. I don't see the need to do that. Uh, let's go ahead and send you back to Earth. And then as soon as you get back, we'll send another rocket with some machine parts and electronics. You're good, you're good. We will do a little more food. And then I think once I get to 200 food, I will be fine with that. Oh, CO2 jet propulsion. All right, we've got to build this now. This is like about, this is your breakthrough tech. Uh, let's put you, I'm going to put you out here, about right there. And then we do need to put a power cable, which I didn't do before, but we'll do that now. And I need, I need a fuel refinery about just back over here. And I would like to keep about 50 over there. That would be great. So what this does, your drone hub, if we click on a drone hub here, where is it? There he is. Oh, you know what? Oh my God, I didn't need that one. Um, let's, let's destroy that one. And those will reassign to this drone hub. I didn't need two right next to each other. That was dumb. And this one you can control up to 100. Not a big deal. And they're reassigning automatically. All right, so this drone hub, those drones can work anywhere in this blue area. But outside of it, they can't. So you have to overlap them. So we have this other drone hub right about, uh, right about, he right about here, right? Right there. So he can reach down here and then work this area. What this will do is these guys can go anywhere on the frickin' map. 
anywhere on the map. <laughs> now, I need three machine parts to uh, three electronics to complete that. So it'll take a little while. And we're just going to kind of work our way around there. And then, so they're moving it from here to here. And you know what? I want to build a universal depot here. The reason I want that one, no fuel, is so this drone hub can access that. And in fact, I'm going to ask for at least 10 of everything. I don't need food there, and I don't need rare metals. We don't need that, however. All right. I do need some more waste rock storage as that's filling up. So that'll make it easy to get this done. We are doing very good there on water. Uh, a little more food, sure. And that'll get us to 200 there. And then I can switch it over and we can try to get something else. Unfortunately, electronics and machine parts are the hardest thing. All right, an unknown rival is streaming propaganda videos. Uh, so we are going to have to choose one or the other. Now, the good thing is, remember, we don't have any specialized employees outside of the ones that have been training. And so far, they were all botanists. So, and we do have medics, but we don't have any geologists or engineers. So, and I just picked the wrong freaking one. Because I just clicked it. That was dumb. Oh, well. <laughs> All right. We do have uh, an unemployed. So you know what? I'm going to turn this back on. And we're going to let people start filling into there. Now, when you shut a building down, uh, it does have to be repaired. So that is a problem. And they do need two machine parts to get it fixed. So this guy's almost back to Earth. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to send one of our four remaining supply pods because they travel very fast. And then I'm going to send a cargo rocket. Unfortunately, I don't have any money, but we're going to go ahead and launch with five of each. And we'll get some more rare metals for sure. All right. He is working on rare metals here. Uh, you, what are you doing? Can we, oh, you know what? I meant to tell you to auto gather, but I am going to tell you to grab rare metals and bring those back over here. That'll be good right next to that. And the reason I have this stockpile here is so when we do do a machine factory, we've got the rare metals for that. All right, so that's coming up. This will give more comfort just for having a farm in the dome which will increase birth rates. So that'll be good. Uh, that'll get us bigger domes. Uh, let's see. I do need, let's go ahead and do the polymer. Uh, actually, before we do that, let's do this one. Less maintenance, that's huge. And let's go ahead and do sterling generators and get some stuff going there. And I'm going to have to actually leave in a little while because I got to go get my second uh covid vaccine today but that's at 3 30. very cool all right uh do i want more food i don't think so let's try to get that changed and see if we can offer machine parts and you know what i'm gonna build another trade pad right there we're gonna have you come in and land here and anybody? Yep, yeah, they're, they're already building it. That's good. All right, so let's try food for machine parts. We'll try both. Uh, no fuel for shuttles. That should be a short-lived problem. There it is. All right, so our shuttles are up and running. All right, I, I would like to build three more, but I don't have the machine parts yet. But what those guys will do is they will go to all of our... They will pick up everything. Uh, in fact, I wonder, I'm just curious if they will come down here. They may not. That would be too bad. All right, well, all right, we've got a rocket ready to come in. He's got five and five. Really, the only reason I sent him was to try to get some more rare metals. And you know what? Let's, let's send you automated 
Yeah, let's just send you back and forth. Well, no, let's not do that. All right, but you are ready to go now. There you are. All right, biome engineering. So there's your farm comfort. So now we're up to 70% here. All right, what do we want to... Uh, seven, eight, nine. All right. This is taking a minute, isn't it? He needs excess waste rock. Wow, okay. Um, you. Can we... I'm looking for waste rock. Um, hmm. Oh, you know what? We'll just get it from up here because this will be the best thing. All right, so let's load waste rock. And we will dump that right there. And then he's got the waste rock to do with as he needs. That'll be good. No anomalies going on. Nothing up there. Right. What I would like to do when he gets back, I'm going to send a prefab because we have not opened the rare metals yet uh, or the, uh, the electronics factory. So we'll send an electronics factory back, a full size one. We'll put pop it in there. All right. So we now have engineers. So we've got some engineers coming in. An officer. Cool. All right. I'm going to go ahead and open that up. That's fine. And you can see now we're maxing everything out at 40. And uh, we're at 77. Optimal is 55. So that's huge. So we're actually doing very, very good now. All right. You've got 30 out of 180. 57. So as these fill up, then we will need more. Um, I don't really want to build. We've got plus 20 here. I'm going to go ahead and build some more solar panels. Let's see. I think. Oh, no, not that one. Let's do that. That'll be good. All right, we found an anomaly, and can you come scan that? We do have a great dust storm incoming. Well, that'll be interesting. All right, uh, let's bring... I don't know if we're going to get uh, tourists in this playthrough, since we didn't get any in our initial... in our initial batch. Hmm. Okay, I do want the electronics factory. Yeah, we've got the machine part, so I want that. And, yep, I guess that's all we're going to bring this time. Let's check on him. All right, he got some of this waste rock. He actually has plenty up here now. All right, so he's brought some more. I don't need him doing that anymore. All right, we'll we'll just kind of break that off, and then he can start gathering up all these resources. That'll be good. I would not mind another transport, since I'm using these drillers. I don't want to build another dome until we get the until this one's done. We're almost done with it. Um, let's go ahead and do residences have more comfort. That's the low end residences like apartments. So that's good. All right. We have 24 of 48. We have two of 24. We've only got two people training, two people in school. All right. You're full. You're full. I really need somebody in there. Food is definitely coming together. That's great. Now, again, this would be one of those things now where we're kind of stable. We'd bring in one or two loads, pat, rocket loads of passengers. 
Uh, he's died of old age, so that's, you know, that's too bad, but it happens. All right, so new dome. All right, where do we want to put this bad boy? I'm thinking I do have a research boost here. Now, the problem is I still am not in a big hurry just because this dome's not full. I mean, I got a long way to go. I just don't know what else to do here to increase births any faster. I mean, I guess it's going fast enough, but I've never tried a playthrough like this where I'm trying to build the population on planet. Uh, so that is odd. We are, uh, we're down to 10 Earthborn, so we've lost two of our founders to, to death, and we have 15 Martianborn. So that's, uh, that's a good thing, I suppose. All right, this is cranking out really well. Food is going up immensely. I'm going to go ahead and raise this one up to 50, just to have it. In fact, let's, uh, let's do a control shift. There you go. That way, everything will be set to 50. They'll start pulling out of here. And uh, you know what? I'm going to add one more. No, I'm going to do all three of them. The hell with it. Hell with it. I'm doing it. Now, the other thing I could do is I could do away with farming completely if I needed to, right? All right, you're ready to land. Um, oh, crap. All right, the rocket is a small jet of liquid. So we can attempt to land, but then the rocket could explode. We can jettison the payload, but then the cargo is lost, but the rocket will be safe. Ah, oh, that sucks. That sucks. Luckily, I don't need that right away, and we'll be able to resend a rocket with... Oh, man, that's horrible. Well, he certainly can't take off here. All right. Oh, boy. That sucks when you get hit with one of those. All right, we're still at 14,500 water in there. Things are coming together. We discovered a rare metal deposit. That is... No, not that. Why do I have two RC commanders? I don't remember. Um, you, where are you at? Okay, so he's way out there. I'm going to bring him back up here just so he's nearby. Uh, where are you? You're here. You're up here. Fair enough. Oh, we did build this up here. So let's take a look. So now we have a sensor tower boost from this one. That's giving us a little bit of an additive. And how are you doing? Where are you at? Oh, you're right there. All right, so what's the deal? What are we doing? All right. He is working away diligently. That's good. All right, this guy's done. So I'm going to ask you to gather rare metals and then get those back up here. And then you, now that I've done that, um, where, where do I want to send you now? I guess I could send you up here. Wish it wouldn't always do that. All right, he'll come up and he'll start working that. He's got 185 left. And we'll call that an episode, guys. Hit the like button for me. Subscribe if you don't mind. That'll keep you up to date for daily content here on the channel. We'll see you next episode here on Surviving Mars. Take care. Bye.